The National Aeronautics and Space Administration, also known as NASA, is the agency of the United States government that is in charge of the nation's civilian space program. Since 1958, NASA has been discovering lots of things from space and making lots of inventions. Some of the things they have been doing in the X-15 rocket plane, Project Mercury, Project Gemini, Project Apollo, Skylab, and many more. But behind all these accomplishments is a technology that makes it all possible. The rockets that propel NASA space explorations into the sky. Since 1960, Marshall Space Craft Flight Center has provided all of NASA's rocketry and spacecraft propulsion units. Throughout the years, the company has gained partners and the efforts have led to a new propulsion technologies that have carried over to different fields, such as firefighting. Rory Grunewald, the chief engineer of Orbitex subsidiary, HMA Fire saw potential in much of Orbitex proportional technologies far beyond space exploration. The company went through excessive research with the U.S. Air Force Fire Rescue Research Group to develop ways of more efficiently extinguish car hydrocarbon-based fuel fires. They then explored ways to improve the efficiency of fire suppression systems by having the fire put out in less time and the amount of water used to put out the fire decreased. They wanted something more effective and safer for firefighters. The HMA system used 20 gallons per minute at a 1,400 pound per square inch discharge capability versus the usual system that used 100 gallons per minute at 125 pound per minute square inch discharge capability. The average firefighting system extinguished a living room in 1 minute and 45 seconds and used 220 gallons of water. The HMA system extinguished an identical fire in 17.3 seconds using only 13.6 gallons. The HMA hose only takes one person to manage, while a normal hose takes at least four people. An HMA fire system extinguished 380 gallons of JPA fuel spread over 3,500 square feet in fewer than 32 seconds using only 13 gallons of suppressant. The hose works by using ultra high pressure to create minuscule water droplets that are then delivered at an extremely high velocity. This method of extinguishing fires quickly separates the fire from the fuel source and leaves a thin blanket in wake to prevent the fire from regenerating. Ultra high pressure systems from HMA Fire are the next stage in fast, safe, and efficient fire suppression. It does to low pressure systems what hand pumps did to bucket brigades. The advantage is smaller water droplets, delivering more fire suppressing surface area. In a side-by-side -side comparison, low pressure drops are 64 times larger than a UHP droplet. Because UHP uses more water effectively, you end up using two-thirds less suppressant than a traditional low pressure system. More surface area, more contact with the flames, quicker fire suppression, less wasted water. Ultra high pressure from HMA Fire, the evolution of fire suppression. The HMA systems are light and compact, perfect for off-road UTVs and pickup trucks. The system also has very positive ventilation capabilities and it fights the fire's biggest weapon, heat. Tons of fire departments are now interested in the technology's NASA-enhanced capabilities, meaning cities and towns nationwide could soon benefit from another example of space exploration technology improving daily life.